Hello everyone, Crystal Vigia here. Welcome to a new part of my Let's Play of Scooby-Doo and the Cyber Chase. We are finally playing as Scooby again and joining me once again for this is the third time, Noelle McDavid, welcome back to the show. You've landed inside Hello! Third time's a charm, right? It is, it is. <laughs> now what's, what's... Uh, where's Fred? Come on, Fred. Give me some time. I remember playing this in my living room around Christmas time when oh. I was a kid. Like, I just had the nostalgic throwback, yep. Can, can I just say, like, yeah, I'm not, it's honestly same here. Like, I remember there's a bit with the, with the water, but I don't actually remember this specific yep. section. But what I want to say is, oh my god, does it feel good to play a Scooby again? Oh, thank goodness. He is so much better than... than He's so much shit. better, yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, like, it's darn just so smooth. There are giant For sure. <laughs> Fuck. Oh. Velma, you freaking distracted me. Sorry, I mean, Daphne, you <laughs> absolute bitch. How dare Daphne? How dare Sarah Michelle Jeller? Oh, my God. <laughs> hey, fun fact, fun fact about Scooby-Doo as well. Do you know it was filmed in Australia, the first one? No, I didn't know that. It was that. filmed in the Gold, on the Gold Coast, which is in uh, Queensland, uh, at uh, Movie World, so which cool. is like a theme park. Part of it was filmed at a theme park. And yeah, that's why a lot of the cast, um, or like a lot of the... Um, that's why, yeah, a bunch of the, uh, what's it called, like, like extras and stuff like that were Australian, including the wrestler character oh. was actually an Australian, the one that was like oh, the really? fights. Sarah Michelle? Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, 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 I remember that. That's cool. Fun fact. And that, again, yeah. I, again, I only found this out like again like like this time like last week when i was in japan like it's 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 funny and and on top of that on top of that i'll give you some more trivia because we're just gonna go crazy on the trivia right now is that um it was actually written by james gunn who you may know as the disgraced disney guy who wrote um guardians of the galaxy that made those like pedophile jokes and everyone got really upset at him and, and then, what yeah so he was like the, oh he's the writer, God, no, no. director of guardians of the galaxy yeah so and, oh, sure, and just now, oh shit, fuck, just before the checkpoint too, fuck. Oh. Um, um, one other thing, interesting to note, is that originally, the Scooby-Doo, the, the, the movie, was going to be, like, basically aimed at, like, teens and adults. It was going to be, like, hell, like, edgy and shit, and, like, like all adult and stuff. Um, so really? instead, they, yeah, so, but instead they, they thought it would be bad, you know, kids wouldn't, you know, it wouldn't be marketable to kids. And then... I guess it was a different time, you know, like the early 2000s. And then... Yeah. But then if you think about it, they, they do try and sneak in some adult references. Like, apparently, you know, like the scene where they're like... looks like they're smoking, but they're actually like just like eating food in the car. Do you remember that one where they're like at the... Um, they're at the they're at the uh, like the beach and they're like cooking up you know sausages and something and it's like smoke's yeah. coming through the car and it's meant to be like oh they're token you know like they're smoking. Oh weed or something. yeah 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 yeah. yeah so. That's funny now because it's been so long since I've seen it I wouldn't have caught that as a kid obviously. No, no of course yeah. I didn't know what the fuck weed yeah. was until I, actually I was too old <laughs> seriously. Yeah me too again, we me do. And you, me, and, me and you are like non weed smokers so. Yeah. We are we are we're non stoners. Yeah yeah. Non stoners. I don't. I'm high on life. Thank you very much. <laughs> Literally me. <laughs> Shit. Ah. That's all right. It's okay. You know, this is. I actually. I actually like the design of the the, the mon like the. What are the fuck are the dinosaurs in this? It's actually they. Me they're, too. They're simple, but they're cute, and they like. Yeah, they are cute. Deformed as well. I don't know how something can be cute and deformed, but it's true. And don't question. I love how like they're not that much bigger than Scooby. Like they are, but oh, Scooby's like... a beast, man. He don't fuck yeah. with me. He'll <laughs> fuck you up. It's a, it's a, it's a time. Ruby, Ruby, Ruby yeah. will yeah mess with you. Scooby, Dooby, Doo, there... will fuck with you. Okay. See if I anytime I sing that song, it's stuck in my head like, for like three days. It's yeah. just so catchy. I don't know. Yeah, I, I, <laughs> it's very true. It's very true. But Do yeah, notice... I watch okay, old cart. Oh, sorry, I mean, interrupt you. Um, yeah, fuck you. I watched like old cartoons <laughs> only as a kid, so I watched like 80s stuff, which is weird, because so like the stuff that's nostalgic to people now isn't nostalgic to me, because I didn't watch many 90s cartoons. I watched did you, like. Did you Scooby not Doo, watch? You did not watch uh, Rugrats. I didn't really. I mean, I knew mm. about it. I'd seen mm. it, but I didn't watch it um, religiously. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, <you're good. laughs> like, fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> you, know, you know what I mean? Like, like, like oh, you're not welcome back. <laughs> no, no, no. This is this, guys. An obituary, an obituary for Noah McDavid. Uh, parts, <laughs> parts two to four of uh, Scooby Doo and the Cyber Chase, and that one drunk stream where I fucked up my life. Um, <laughs> you know what's weird though is that like, 
That's I am crazy. the biggest That's crazy. 90s geek for shows, movies, and music, but cartoons, I didn't watch them. It's mostly because my mom, like, she didn't like, like, I never watched Spongebob because she was like, ew, I don't like it, you can't watch that. Because she just assumed it was, like, inappropriate. She, she never just, gave it, like, a chance. I was going to say, uh, yeah. she sounds like uh, James Dobson, that Christian dude that was like, oh, Spongebob, <laughs> Spongebob promotes homosexuality, so we have to be banned. <laughs> Because there's an episode where That's there's an hilarious. episode. It's one of my favorite episodes. It's where SpongeBob and Patrick raise like a little shellfish or something like that. And then at Aww. the end of the episode, I'm, I've I got deep nostalgia about this. By the way, this section here for some reason. It's yes, like, me too. I remember. Oh my this. god, it's Lapras. Um, but um, <laughs> um, basically, yeah. At the end of the episode, it's like he like does these sort of gestures, sort of like thrusty sort of gestures, and Patrick says, "Let's have another," as in like let's have another baby. Like and, right. it's like, and it was like meant to be, oh no, it's like encouraging, um, you know, it's encouraging homosexuality. Can't have that. That is so funny. Um, oh my God. Apparently, yeah. So. Yeah. Th yeah, I was raised like super protected, but thankfully it was never really like homophobia, which turned out good since I'm <laughs> a lesbian. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say that, that could have, that could have gone a lot worse. Yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. But my mom was just like, if she thought a show had like bad manners, like she would just be like, no, you can't watch that. Which is probably why I'm so like awkward about so many things these days. Cause like I do have really like strict manners and stuff when it comes to like, you know, stuff that was supposed to be funny when we we're kids, I never thought was funny. Yeah. Um, so yeah, but I watched like the, I don't know if you've heard of the channel Boomerang. It was like Cartoon Network's like Boomerang. throwback yeah. channel. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, okay, that's all I watched, basically, so I watched Scooby-Doo and Flintstones and Jetsons oh, yeah, yeah, and all yeah, that yeah, stuff, yeah, yeah, yeah. I see, see, Scooby I... Scooby-Doo is my fave. Never, yeah, see, I was always a Nickelodeon kid, like, basically from, like, day one, uh, when I had, when I got, like, cable TV, um, because... Right. Because, see, like, for some reason, and maybe it's, like, the opposite for me, for some reason, when I watched, when I watched those shows... Mm -hmm. something about them felt like too kiddy for me or something weird it's like yeah. i don't know how to describe it i was like i was like yeah it's like when i watched the flints i'm like oh this doesn't seem but like see spongebob kind of had yeah kind of you i guess your mum was kind of right i mean spongebob is really really smart uh, definitely or it was very smart very 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 yeah. like like weird references Ahead. in it and stuff like that and and that's right. kind of what made it um that's kind of what made it so good, though, as well. But you know, like, and why adults still and why exactly why it has an adult, it. Yeah. adult yeah. fan base, yeah, um, and right, not right. not in a My Little Pony way either, like in a more you know actual proper way, you know, like you know right, actually right. actually catered to not not quite like The Simpsons, of course, but you know. Um, yeah, just... Right, yeah, not like freaking Family Guy or something. But... Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I take it you were not allowed to watch The Simpsons as a kid. Oh no no yeah, no no! Yeah, yeah you're, no. you're like Ando. Ando was like that as well. And honestly, really? like yeah, 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 like we've showed Ando like classic episodes of Simpsons, and he loves it. But it's like yeah, he never watched it as a kid. Um, and right. That I mean, yeah, The Simpsons. Have you have you ever seen much of it now? Or um, I've seen like a lot of clips and stuff, but yeah. like to sit down and watch an episode, I haven't. But wow. Um, this but, yeah. yeah it's very it, yeah the early episodes are just amazing like they're just so well done and like honestly honestly in a way watching it as a kid is kind of wasted um yeah because you wouldn't really understand it anyway like this if that is not a kid show like the simpsons isn't actually a kid show you know that's sort of the difference right. um what right. the hell we're gonna avoid this uh... let's, let's see what freddy has to say hopefully please let me talk to you fred <laughs> Help. Those dinosaurs look a little too big for your pie attack, Scooby. Just oh. move around them real attack. Attack. <laughs> attack. <Shut laughs> the... Scoob, calm down, mate. Oh, that's funny. Scooby's lost his marbles. Move around them real carefully. Honestly, I, I like the I like the level design of this level though. I I, I like the text. I mean, the text is obviously super low quality, but I like that like traverse from the jungle to like the Lion King here now, and then in the middle there was like yeah. the water. It's, it's, it's cool. Bit of Indiana Jones, you know? Yeah, it, it is. It is. Yeah, On the yeah. bridge. Oh, no. Oh, gee, we got some Crash Bandicoot 1 shit going on here. Dude, this one's nuts. Yeah. Jesus. Like those little single ones. Oh. Damn. Don't like that. them. Look at that. Oh, Damn, yes. son. There you go. And another life, too. We're doing yep. all right for yep, lives. There's more. Oh, God. Okay. Eek. Oh, shit. Fuck. 
Anytime I'm on something like that in a game, I just... I feel like if I breathe, then, like, I'm gonna fall. Yeah, you're gonna push, you're gonna push your controller out of the way. Yeah, yeah, like, I tense up and hold my breath, like, ah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. All right, look at that. I can't, damn, we are, I can't believe we're... We are Tyler breezing through this game. I can't believe we made a WWE reference, <laughs> but I don't care. I have to. It's okay. We can't actually beat the game until Alice joins us at some point. That's like. true. Exactly. That's very true. I've got to get her along for the ride there too. There. Um, Absolutely. That's a Mr. Did she play this? Did she say she played this? I don't even know. But we'll, we'll, speaking we'll of Cindy, yeah, we're, yeah, Cindy? we're supposed to speed run this game. That'll be something. <laughs> really? Nice. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna verse each other. Um, I look forward to in that. In which case, he's going to, he's going to win, because I forgot how hard the controls were until I saw you play it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Especially as fucking I'm like, oh, oh. Shaggy. Yeah. Shaggy douche. Yep. Shit. Rawr. Man, look at this. Oh, I, I actually don't remember this boss, actually, surprisingly. I remember, like, a lot of the other ones, but I don't remember this. I don't either. Shit. Maybe it's because it's so, like, basic. Yeah, it's such a basic bad. <laughs> it's kind of just basic, yeah. Yeah. It's like, here's this room I know, with I know, this dinosaur We know plenty it. of basic things. That you won't say. <laughs> All the basic. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we do. <laughs> You're right. Jeez. So tempted to make an absolutely cunty reference, but I, anyway. Uh, anyway, anyway, anyway. Uh, 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 <laughs> All right, this is, uh, yeah, purple. Or should I say lilac? Or, or no, no. It's, yeah. it's Spyro. Yeah, this is Spyro deformed. This is Spyro in the Evolvo <laughs> right. This is Spyro, like, meets the X-Men and... Yeah. Something goes wrong, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's like mutant Spyro. Ah, mutant. Yeah, no shit. Yeah, yeah. Mm. See, I've only ever seen... My only experience with X-Men is basically Logan, which is a solo movie, and then the Deadpool films. So, like, I'm actually like yeah. not an X-Men guy, believe it or not. I I'm not a lot, but where there's so many crossovers between the Spider-Man cartoons and games, I know a lot about X-Men mm -hmm. from mm -hmm. that, because mm -hmm. he runs into them often. Does he run into the X-Men in, in Spider-Man games? Yeah, um, Dang. in Spider-Man 1 for PlayStation, um, you run into, uh, Blue Beast guy, what is his name? I can't remember. I think it is called Beast, isn't he? I don't know. What the fuck is going on here? Hold up. Look at this, he's getting, he's like getting scared, and I like, have to like... That's, it, oh, he, got, he gets scared, he gets scared, and he stops running. You see that? So yeah, like, gets scared, and he like... Yeah. That's fucked. That doesn't seem like... <laughs> yeah, I guess you gotta like pick the right direction. Sorry, so what were you saying? So, so like in yeah, the first Spider-Man that you're LPing right now, right? Yeah. yeah, yeah. So you run into the Beast guy, you run into Johnny Flame, you run into Daredevil. It's it's cool. Damn, it's cool. that's really There's cool. There's all kinds of like I mean, this Marvel is back crossovers. Before, this is before like the whole Marvel like takeover of the the 2010s. Yeah, yeah. That's really cool. Yeah, this was 2000 and 2002, I think. Damn, yeah. I remember we got. I remember we got into Electro. Uh, I remember Matt from Barrow got it for his birthday. The second one. Um, I love that My game. favorite Spider-Man, of course, being Spider-Man Two on the PS2, which is like the, oh, yeah. the most Me critically too. acclaimed one of the series. Oh, yeah. I, I should which is why the new actually. one's going to be so great. Exactly. If it's anything like that one. Free roaming. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Free swinging and actual model of New York. It's going to be so good. I'm ready. Oh, it's a model of New York, is it? Yeah. Yeah. It's it's going to be like. Bomb as heck. I saw a comparison between Spider-Man 2 for PS2 and the new one of like the Empire State Building. And awesome. oh my god, I'm awesome. I'm ready. But yeah, you should do a let's play of that one. I would so freaking join you for that. See, I don't have a. I, I would have done that instead of the PlayStation One ones, but, but I don't have an emulator yeah, yeah, for yeah. PS2. Oh, yeah, and so, on a Mac, you know. on a Mac, it's kind of a nightmare. Don't even don't even bother. Yeah, and it's basically impossible to find. I've closest thing I've ever found was a the Dolphin emulator for GameCube, oh, but. Yeah. My controller won't work with it for some reason. So. Now, like, one, one sec, I'm going to save state here like a little cheating bitch okay. because I want to figure <laughs> out. Okay, so that's okay. So, uh, so he just freezes, and then See, that's like not fair. Like, what are you supposed to do? Okay. And then the chances keep not yeah. happening. Yeah. Okay, maybe he's got to get out of the way. Damn. Okay. What the well, heck? That, that's a bit problematic. I am... Yeah, that's oh. dumb. Nope. Okay, I'm trying again. <laughs> I'm sorry, I have no shame. No, I'm... I would do the same freaking thing. That's get, weird. Get the fucking way, you... What the fuck? 
There's literally no way to move. Yeah, this is fucked. Okay. You just gotta get as far away as possible, I guess. Yeah. There you go. Oh no. What? Well. This is weird. LP over, guys. <laughs> it broke us. Yeah. Oh, what the fuck. What is what is LP over from? Oh my god, that is like an. I know it sounds oh, like maybe... so weird to quote myself, but that is an iconic like crystal if vision like you... thing. LP over. You're you're doing it though. If you jump when he throws his tail down, you don't freeze. Oh. Well. Yeah. Yeah, I noticed that because you didn't what? freeze those last Noel. two times and you were mid air. Nick David. <laughs> Yeah, as long as you're mid-air. Yep, there's a chance. Oh my goodness. Yes. This is what this is why the queen joins me for these parts. Thank <laughs> you. Legend. Sometimes like it help well see my mom always like watched me play video games. She refused to play them, but she always watched me. <laughs> and honestly, she made good observations. Like she'd tell me something and I'm like, no, that's not it. And then she'd end up being right, and I'm like, oh. Like because like I don't mom, know, it's different shut when someone's up, watching. Please. <laughs> Mom, that's not it, okay? Yeah. And then like ten minutes later, I'm like, okay, mom, you're right. <laughs> and yeah, no, my my dad would be gloating for a while about that, I'm sure. <laughs> well, well done, good good observation there. That is that's why that's why we have guest commentators, I guess. You know, that's that's a, hey. especially ones that can see the screens. That's perfect. We did it. We did it. <laughs> yes, that well, does make it more fun. You never know your luck in the big city, and I guess we'll find out in the next part. Um, Ooh. Thanks again, Noel. Great stuff, and uh, I shall. Uh, we shall be back in the next part, possibly with someone else, possibly just by you, depending on what the schedule is going. Depends on who's free and yep. and who's cool. who's willing to spill the tea with me. Um, <laughs> uh, even though we won't be, we will not be bitching in this part. But I just wanted an excuse to say spill the tea. Um, <laughs> thank you guys for watching. Thanks, Noel. Make sure you subscribe to her, and we'll be back very thank soon you. with more. Goodbye. Bye.